Big news coming to the Polkadot Kusama ecosystem. Welcome back, guys, for another YouTube video, All in Crypto here. And today, we're going to be covering Polkadot and what's currently taking place with its ecosystem. You guys will know that we recently had Alex Wilkie from Pendulum on the channel. Now, Alex Wilkie is um, a real entrepreneur in the crypto space, somebody that it was an absolute honor to talk to. Um, and a very interesting guy uh, that I hope I can maintain a relationship with. And of course, he came on the show to talk about Pendulum, um, this kind of Forex, this decentralized Forex platform that is built on top of Polkadot. It was the fastest ever parachain to win a slot. Now, essentially, there has been a bridge and part of um, Pendulum was uh, to create this bridge, which would essentially bridge all the stable coins from the Stellar network over to Pendulum, which would inherently unlock all these stable coins for the wider Polkadot ecosystem, obviously, as it is an interoperable uh, protocol. So that's exactly what we're going to be diving to diving into in this one, guys. There are opportunities everywhere in this market. Um, and it's up to you guys to try and find them. And hopefully on this channel, we will help you. Pendulum is definitely a project that I'm interested in. And also actually stellar to some degree. So we're going to cover it all, guys. Polkadot, um, you know, and, and how this actually is going to affect the broader ecosystem. I think we're going to see a lot of value flow in to, you know, if you look at DeFi, for example, and you look at your typical choices for what you can farm DeFi with, it's usually US dollars. But actually stellar have an array of, you know, you can see Euro, US, uh, Dollar, Japanese Yen, Nigerian, uh, Naira, you know, the pounds. You can see um, a whole list of uh, currencies here that you can kind of run on Stellar and, of course, now are going to be onboarded to the Polkadot ecosystem. So let's get straight into it, guys. Crypto payment specialist Stellar bridges fear and stable coins to Polkadot. The Spacewalker Bridge, built by recent parachain winner Pendulum, is focused on connecting DeFi to 4X markets. Now, there's a massive need for this, guys. I'm going to leave a link in the description to my interview with Alex Wilkie. Um, it was a great one. You know, like I say, very, very smart uh, and intelligent individual. Um, and Pendulum is a really exciting project to come to the um, Polkadot space. Cryptocurrency payment specialist Stellar is linking to Polkadot and its sister network Kusama via the newly built Spacewalker Bridge, a move that will connect the two blockchain ecosystems with Stellar's fear on ramp around the world. So one big problem you have with DeFi, and we've actually seen Coinbase look to uh, tackle this issue with their base um, layer two, is there's a, it's almost a bottleneck um, between Fear on ramp, so us taking money out of our bank accounts and then getting it to DeFi. A lot of people don't know how to do this. And actually, there's going to be a connection here with Stellar's very easy on ramps into Polkadot. Um, so, this is a liquidity channel that's essentially now been opened up that I think in time is going to be proven to be a special one. Now, I'm going to say this and I'm going to stick my neck on the line here and probably upset a few people. I personally, right now, believe that there is more innovation taking place within the Polkadot ecosystem than anywhere else. We constantly see Polkadot right up there on the GitHub uh, rankings in terms of um, devlogs. Um, and it is just nothing short of impressive. Now, I'm a massive Polkadot bull and have become even more so. I will be releasing a, uh, a list of altcoins um, that I'm a fan of. And I can tell you Polkadot is pretty much at the top. And if you guys want to jump that and you want to find out what I'm buying, where I'm buying, you know, we've been killing it this year, killed it all of last year, feel free to join the uh, Patreon in the description. But enough of that, guys. So the bridge built by recent Polkadot Parachain winner, um, Pendulum aims to connect decentralized finance, DeFi applications with Forex, foreign exchange uh, markets, especially in emerging markets where since it was founded in 2014, Stellar has built up a footprint and partnered with the likes of cross-chain border companies MoneyGram. While crypto's banking uh, rails in the US have largely been dismantled, Seasoned firms like Stellar and others are continuing to build out uh, critical infrastructure 
to do the job elsewhere. The Spacewalker Bridge is now live on Polkadot's so-called Canary Network, Kusama, and the Polkadot version will be open within one or two weeks' time. This is huge news, guys. According to Pendulum's co-founder and chief officer, um, Torsten Stuber, uh, I know that there's quite a lot of Germans uh, that actually... Um, are involved with uh, and we love the germans by the way our, our, our brothers from uh brothers and sisters from across the channel um involved anyway enough about that complete side note there so pendulum's mission is to combine traditional finance with DeFi, said stuba who is also cto at satoshi pay a crypto micro payments firm that has a long history of building on top of stellar the focus is firmly on stable coins or fiat backed uh tokens stuba added and not necessarily lumens the native cryptocurrency of the stellar network but you can have lumens now on polka dot it can exist on polka dot through this bridge it's very very interesting stuff so stellar has a great implementation of stable coins as well as on ramps and off ramps in different countries for different kinds of fiat currencies stuba added um, in an interview with coindesk i don't think you'll find any other network that has so many different fiat uh, currencies tokenized on the platform so this is huge this is the largest fiat back stable coin um ecosystem stellar combining with polka dot through spacewalker bridge which of course pendulum have um released now on kusama in a couple of weeks time on polka dot it's massive guys this news there's so many exciting things happening within the crypto space not just from a price point of view but from a fundamental point of view USDC will be the main stable coin flowing across the Spacewalker Bridge, and it also, and it's also the token Stellar integrated with MoneyGram. That's the first beginning rolling out last year. There will also be an array of regional currency stable coins available, said Toma Weller, Vice President Product at Stellar Development Foundation. This includes tokenized Argentinian pesos and Brazilian reals, as well as Kenyan shillings, at some other African stable coins, and a couple of euro uh, based ones, well as said. Basically, every MoneyGram agent in the world is an excess point to Stellar's network, said Weller in an interview. So users can off ramp their Stellar assets to actual cash, cash in more than three. 100,000 locations around the world. They can also access and on-ramp their cash to crypto and specifically stable coins in smaller subset of that. Uh, and we're slowly rolling out that. And we're slowly rolling that out more and more in other countries. So this is huge news. You now have a link between Stellar and Pendulum and thus the wider ecosystem of Polkadot and Kusama. So this is huge news. This is something that personally I'm extremely excited about. We know actually, if you look in regards to total value locked within DeFi, stable coins make up, barring a few ecosystems, probably the majority. Um, and not only are you going to have your typical stable coins on Polkadot, but you're actually going to have, um, you know, some weird and wonderful ones and a whole variety of them, courtesy of the um, Spacewalker Bridge. So this is massive. I think Pendulum is a project to watch, guys. You can recently, I believe, actually buy the pen token. Not financial advice for anybody. Please go and watch my interview with Alex Wilkie for more of an in-depth guide on, on himself and, 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 and or not guide, more of a kind of in-depth um, interview and, and, and commentary on, on Pendulum and, of course, himself and Satoshi Pay and all these things. But this is fantastic. And, and, and this is not the first time that we've seen Polkadot create a bridge to other ecosystems. You guys will know that we interviewed um, Brainjar from Composable. Great interview, by the way. I'll also leave a link to that in the description, um, where essentially we spoke about IBC coming to Polkadot and what this means. It essentially gives a link between every other IBC chain to Polkadot. I think Polkadot is going to be this kind of hub, almost like a kind of, um, you know, market, if you will, where all your traders and all your kind of traffic flows towards and through. Uh, I really do see that and, and what we're seeing from Pendulum, what we're seeing from, from, from Composable and what we're seeing across the board within the Polkadot ecosystem is insane. And actually there are certain projects out there that are actually, there's reasons why you might want to have um, tokens on 
Polkadot and within the Polkadot ecosystem. One, one that's coming very soon is that you will essentially be able to um, privatize any token through a very simple interface and then send that around privately without anybody really knowing um, what's going on. Now, you may see that as a regulatory issue, but there are ways that you can, you know, you can show that data to the, to the needed parties, but it's just more for the broader scope of people. Um, so that, you know, if you're thinking about payrolls and all this other weird and wonderful ways that we're going to use crypto in the future, um, you know, it's kind of shelter from that. But I'm rambling on now, guys. It is a big advancement. The Spacewalker Bridge, first on Kusama, then coming to Polkadot itself. And we'll see over the coming years just how much of an important role this potentially plays. And, and, and the Polkadot ecosystem now has a link to the Stellar One and a bridge where traffic and liquidity can fl flow freely. It also provides us with a lot of on-ramps and so on and so forth. That's all I've got for you in this video, guys. If you enjoyed the content, like us, I'd appreciate it. So as a comment, and I'll catch you all in the next one. Thanks a lot for watching, ladies and gentlemen. See you in the next.